In this video, I will discuss Playwright architecture. So here there are two components. One is client and another one is Playwright Node.js server. So in the client, that is where we are writing a automation test using TypeScript, JavaScript, Python, Shishab.net or a Java. And in the Playwright Node.js server, so this particular server, which will communicate with the browser engines by using the CTP protocol, that is a Chrome DevTools protocol. And also we are using another protocol here called WebSockets protocol. So this is responsible for to establish the connection between the client and the Playwright Node.js server. So let me summarize how exactly it works. So if you look at this one, so firstly, we are writing a code that is automation code using any of the programming language. And then when you trigger the test case execution. So firstly, connection will be established with the Playwright server that is a Playwright Node.js server. And what client does is it converts all the automation test into the JSON format and it will send to server over the WebSocket protocol here. And once Playwright Node.js server receives the automation test information, it communicates with the respective browser engines by using the CTP protocol. And once the execution is completed on all the browsers or any specific browsers, it will return the that means it will captures the all the test execution information. Then it will send back to the client. So that is where we are writing the code. That is where we are executing the playwright tests. 